How's it going everybody? Welcome to another video of Midwest Duckman. I'm Tyler and no currently isn't with me today but I have something very very exciting to share with you guys. As you guys can probably tell by the title you'll know what I'm going to be showing you. Now whether you know what it is or not that's a different story. But without, uh, without further ado let's, uh, let's show you what we got. Oh wait hold on. So I, uh, I got an Illumicraft uh, a few months ago and I was going to use it as like an overall like fishing boat kind of um, just a river runner type stuff but uh, yesterday was the end of urban early season goose uh, here in Iowa so we hunted that yesterday and yesterday was a pretty busy day for me uh, I took that aluminum craft went and got rid of it and got this in return you ready to see what it is A 1998 Sea Arc 1460. It has a 15 horse Merc on the back, tiller, with shallow drive. It's a 14 foot or 14 and a half feet, uh, six feet across the rear. Uh, it's a semi V, and it is made for duck hunting. I can't wait to uh, to get this thing out and kill some ducks in it. But we're going to be doing a build video with this boat. Um, I know there's been quite a few build videos, but this is going to be our build video. Um, I'm, I'm really, really excited for it. Uh, we're going to go through like everything from changing all this stuff out, because this is a little janky to front lights, to sea uh, deck, uh, new lights on the trailer. Um, there's there's going to be a lot, actually. And I will take you guys through the entire build process. Everything from the trailer to the boat to the blind, everything. So this is going to be, actually going to be a multi-purpose boat. Um, during the off season when we're not duck hunting, this is going to be a river runner. And it's going to be kind of kind of be a fishing boat for me, but uh, I have the bass boat over there. That was weird. My camera died. So anyway, my bass boat got that as my tournament rig from my other YouTube channel, Fishing with Ty. So this is going to be kind of like my my everything else boat that I don't feel like dragging a big fiberglass bass boat. We'll go do like short lake days, stuff like that. It's gonna be amazing. It's a super light trailer or super light boat and trailer. So it's not gonna eat fuel out of my truck. But uh yeah. There really isn't much to it. Got the the bench, got the front deck, seat, rear seat, fuel tank, battery, and the uh and the tiller. There isn't much to this boat, which I'm a fan of. But um, I'll, I'll quit Ratchet John about the boat. Uh, next time you see me, it'll be me and my daughter out on the marsh testing this thing out. Might as well go do a test run in the marsh since that's where she's going to be a majority of the time. So uh, stay tuned and I'll see you guys on the water. So guys, I made it to the ramp. I got my daughter here. She's going to ride with me on the initial test of the boat. So we're going to get onto the marsh here. And we're gonna we're gonna run around a little bit. I'm gonna put the GoPro on my head, and we'll uh, we'll get some footage. Lots to take some pictures out there and some other things. There we go. So uh, yeah, we're in the boat. Kinda. We'll go this way. So just taking out for a little uh little test ride.
Hold on. Okay, guys, give me one sec. I'll be right back. Okay. Good job. We're All right, guys. So I stopped, took some pictures. I'll. This thing's actually running pretty damn well. I'm uh. I haven't really got to open it wide open yet, but because you know, we're in a duck marsh. And this marsh really ain't that deep, so it's hard to, uh... It, it's hard to really judge, like, the, the handling, the capabilities of it, but it seems pretty agile. Yeah. If I do, I'm gonna have to... I've shut the motor off so I don't blow it up. Yeah, that hurt. Can I see that? How deep is it back here? Mm -hmm. ah, a few inches. Apparently we can take skinny water with it. That's all I care about. We're pretty far back here. Want to see how much farther back we can go? Yeah. You paddle. <laughs> you paddle, I'll use the motor. How about that? No, that's not it. This is really shallow back here. Yeah, yeah it's really shallow back here. Oh. Let me see it. I'm gonna have to flip this around. Let's see. Well, it's not that shallow, it's just... Oh, there's a bunch of this grass, that's why. Seems like this motor doesn't like that grass. That's why I brought oars. Let's go down the other way. Uh, just weeds. I think here comes a duck. What? I think here comes a duck. Do it. I don't, it's not duck season. Or else I, or else I would. Yeah. What? <laughs> here you go.
What do you think, stink bug? Good. You like it? Yeah. Good boat? Yeah. Oh man, okay. I'll tell you what, running the tiller in the uh, in the marsh, it really works out that all that all right cannon. Frog. So Peanut, what do you think? You like the boat? Yeah. Is it a good boat? Can you help me? Alright, give me a minute. I'm can I can I sign out of my video real quick? So hopefully you guys enjoyed this little announcement video and maiden voyage. And what did I say? I said wait. And um, and thank you for coming along with Peanut and I as we as we take this maiden voyage with the uh, with the duck boat. We named it what? Annie. 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 That's yeah. the name of the boat. It's named after. Um, it's named after my late grandmother. Her middle name was Ann, so we named the boat Annie. It was Mima's middle name. Oh, Ann? Mm-hmm. So we named the boat Annie. Annie? Yep. It has Ann. Mm-hmm. So if you guys enjoyed this video, if you did, make sure to hit that, what, like button? And what, what channel should they subscribe to? Midwest Duckman? Yeah, you guys should subscribe for that. So, as always, guys, hunt smart, hunt safe, and I'll see y'all out on the water. What do you think? You ready to go home? So am I.